Fuck me, I'm glad that scene is over. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I dreaded this. When I started the game, I dreaded this. Welcome, welcome, bienvenue back to The Last of Us Part 2. And I don't want to do this. <laughs> that will be the tagline for this for this part, for this episode. Um, it's been a while that I played because um, I played this before um, and I don't want to do this. I, <laughs> I really don't want to. Damn, I even forgot, like, I don't know what to do. Okay. Like, I forgot everything. Okay. I've been playing okay. Metamorphosis in the meanwhile. Ready? And Made of Scare. And Metamorphosis is a delight. So this is also a tough break when it comes to um, mood. Because <laughs> Metamorphosis is a surreal game. You're playing as a Gregor Zamza as a bug. And it's really fun, light-hearted, very cute. And now we're back to Murder Alley, you know. So it's a little bit of a cut. It's a little bit, you know, of a change in pace. Ugh. Oh, can I even go there? Damn. Pretty much all dead. Yeah, that's uh that's gotta be tough to see. Damn. And remember, Abby still thinks it's just Tommy. Because they have no idea that yeah, he's been tracking us. They have no idea that it's Ellie. Um because so far she's only met Tommy. You know, and Tommy killed Manny. Which, um, it's not the biggest tragedy of all of at least. Like, er, uh, of course, every death is a tragedy, but it's, you know, all in all, from all the friends of, of Abby we met. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's super kind of unnecessary of me to say that. Do I find something more here? Like story elements, a coin. Would Abby still collect coins in this situation? I feel like. Nah. Oh. Oh, okay. Can't see. Where will you see this, you son of a bitch? She gonna love it. Hands up. Back away from your shit. I said, back up! You're making a big mistake. Don't fucking turn around. Love, keep your bow on him. Get on the ground. You gonna kill me like a coward? <laughs> Shoot this one too. Don't, don't you do it, Ellie. Get out of here. Stand up now. Don't you fucking dare. Shut the fuck up. Oh. All right. Stop. Stop. Toss your weapon. Toss your weapon. No. No. I know why you killed Joel. He did what he did to save me. There's no cure because of me. I am the one that you want. Just let him go. You killed my friends. We let you both live. And you wasted it. Wait! Get off of her! Bobby! Come on. No. 
I don't want this. Stay here. Watch the exits. Don't let her leave. I don't want this. Let's just go back to. Oh. Uh, fuck. Don't you fucking run. Oh yeah, running in Last of Us is actually a lot easier than most other games. Sorry. Oh my god. No, I hate this. I hated this so much. When... No! When I had to do this in the first game with... No! Oh shit. Oh my god, I'm, I'm basically dead. Right? No! Can I... Oh my god. I'm dead. Do I n not have any? I don't have. Where are you? Ugh. Remember in the first game, when this was when when we were Ellie, and this the other person was was David, and I hated that. I hated that. Like I played the first game. Oh, you're in here through so many times and I hate it so much this is exactly the kind of gameplay that just makes me sick no no damn no 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 oh my god I don't want to kill Ali. No. I mean, I'm. Do you see the red? Oh no! Oh man, I should have dodged. No. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> it's too fast. I'm so stressed. Oh my god. It's like your two best friends are trying to kill each other. That's. I mean, well. At this point, I don't really like either. But well. It still feels, you know, I don't want to do this. Dodge! Motherfucker! Oh, I'm shaking. My leg is shaking, people. Just FYI. Oh my god. No, don't kill Ellie. Don't kill Ellie. Ellie, don't kill Abby. Be nice to each other. Be nice. Don't. Abby, don't kill Ellie. Abby, Abby. No. Ellie, don't kill Abby. I feel like a mom. <laughs> the kids. Leave. You know, when, when they're fighting and they don't stop. Just hug, alright? Apologize and hug. Hug it out. <laughs> My right leg is shaking so much. Ellie, what are you doing there?
Damn it. I nearly had her. Oh my god. Why is my leg shaking so much? Oh! Shit. Damn it. I don't know where she- Oh, there she is. Okay. Ugh. Damn. But also, this is a cool environment. Like, I really like that. Oh. Yeah, she's setting traps, um, by the way. Ellie is- because she's a smart- she's a smart girl. But also, no, Ellie, don't set traps on your sister. That is rude. Ugh. No! Oh, no! No! Dina, no! Oh my god, no, left! What is the no? Stop! She had nothing to do with it. Oh, Abby, don't you dare hurt Dina. Good. No! Abby. Damn. That's Abby's humanity. That's left. God, oh god, look at Dina, oh my god. She could still lose the baby because shock um, and trauma is really hard on a pregnancy, by the way. I'm shaking all over, this is so... Fuck me, I'm glad that scene is over. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I dreaded this. When I started the game, I dreaded this. Ugh. So back to Herschel's farm, I guess. That's a mocking dad joke, in case anyone watches that. Oh man. <laughs> oh. That's the baby. Thank God. Hey, Naughty Doc did not the. Oh, she lost the baby shtick thing. I got you. Yeah. It's okay. There are giraffes on his jumper. Romper? Oh my god. <laughs> He's adorable. Like, oh my god, with the chubby, chubby face. Do I love fat babies? They're adorable. Also, it's not unhealthy, usually. I once read, like, very chubby babies get more for their brains and they get smart. Just what I tell myself because I was a super chubby baby. Aww. Who's that handsome fellow, huh? It's basically a throwback to the scene in the dinosaur museum when Ali did the faces and Joel was in the background. Because Ali is basically his parent, right? Aww. 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 That's a cool room. Look at that. Oh, she's doing her own. Is she doing her own um, graphic novels now? Damn. Giants of. Th oh, it's still there. Oh, God. And a wooden. Oh, it's one of the Joel. One of Joel's. Um, wooden things. Because he was into woodwork before he died. Oh. Man, all those. Oh, it's the toy. 
from from Sam's toy that Ellie gave him like seconds before he turned. Oh man, this is uh... oh, I th I really forgot how like emotional this game makes me. <laughs> like going from talking bugs to this Tina. is I'm in the kitchen. It's it's a lot. <clears throat> a lot of sheep. Seen one there as well. That is a cute plush sheep. More woodwork. Is that Joel's? I guess so. Because it was cute, I like I I really liked his woodwork. Can we go out? You want some fresh air? No, I I first want to go through the house. Oh, different times. Ah. Oh. Damn. Light of all lives. JJ. Oh, that's Jesse Joel. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. I'm not. Oh, that's beautiful. So that's the, the butterfly slash moth um, on Ellie's guitar. It's an E, that's an D. That's just beautiful flowers. And I think that's the sign. Um, on Ali's bracelet. They are also this, what I talked about, it's um, in different religions it's actually used. Um, it's also in um, Jewish and I think in in, um, in in other religions it's a sign against, it's a symbol for protection. So that's what Dina is doing. Oh, is that her sister? Say hi to your Auntie Talia. Oh. <laughs> so Dina is into um oh damn so cute I have more woodwork from Joel they have it really nice Oh, and also this. I think this is also for, um, like, cleansing the house. Keeping it free from evil spirits. Yay! Boy. Yes! <laughs> Damn. Tough crowd. <laughs> oh. Sorry for taking my time, but I mean, in this game you have such stressful action sequences that it's really, really nice to just walk around. Also, I mean, you you can really enjoy. Oh, what's up, you little boobers? <laughs> hey, thanks for doing the dishes. You can thank me by putting on some music. Yeah, in a second. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. In a second. My dear Dina, thank you for your letter and the photograph. JJ's gotten so big already. Yeah, he's a big boy. He's got Jesse's smile. If he's anything like his dad, well, good luck. <laughs> but Jesse was amazing. I can't wait to visit you. My back has been acting up again, but I'm on the mend. The doctor still thinks I need a few more weeks of rest. As soon as I can, I will be there. I appreciate the tender words in your letter. I will say what I hope is obvious. Jesse wouldn't blame you for what happened, and neither do any of us. We love you. You are part of our family. Be well. There will always be a place for you, Ellie, and JJ. Back in Jackson, should ever, should you ever change your mind. So they moved away. This is a farm far from Jackson. Love, Robin. So this is um, Jesse's mother, I guess. I mean, they said that he had very loving parents, which I think um, explains his whole character. Because especially men, um, like Jesse usually come from families that are very doting with emotions. Oh, in the background, see the Joel and Ellie photo? I'm with you. My bar is very low. <laughs> That's nice music. They have it good. Oh, no pun intended. Makes a small cameo. Ah, 
I love you. I love you too. Oh, that's cute. Cat. Um, I want to look at everything. I'm sorry. I just... Oh, there you go. Sash, peppers, garlic. Oh, they have really... Damn, they have it good. This is a... Oh, my... It, no, that's bread. I thought it was a potato. <laughs> okay, well, let's... Oh, Dina looks... Dina looks great. <laughs> Ooh, look at those moves. These moves? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at Mama. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is kind of working on me. You're weird. I'm aware. Okay. Okay, <laughs> you're distracting me. No. <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. Go. Okay. <laughs> oh, hey. I think I left Ollie outside. Do you mind bringing him back in? Yeah, sure thing. There, another. It's all for protection. Also, spoiler, Ollie is unfortunately, it's not a dog. I know. That is such a dick move by Naughty Dog to not... Like, why wouldn't they have a dog? Didn't Dina want to have a cat or a dog? Didn't she even say that in a conversation when we were in the pet store? Oh, well, maybe when we're done with all this, we can get a nice little creature to take care of. <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh. Hey, let's get you on here. Yes! You know what's beautiful in th with this scene, and I just realized that. Now it's official. So now this is not just Dina, Ellie, and JJ, but it's also Dina, Ellie, JJ, Joel, and Jess. So all the people they really truly loved. Just in case you weren't teary-eyed enough as of yet. And if you don't care about this anyways, well, you know, then don't. Oh, but they have sheep. Why do they have sheep and not a Why wouldn't they have a dog? I don't get it. There's no reason. Look, if Daryl Dixon in The Walking Dead can have a dog that behaves with the zombies and hadn't hasn't died so far. I haven't seen season 10. Please don't spoiler me if the dog dies. Um, then Ellie and Dina can have a dog. I mean... Everything clo is closed up, so they can have it run around. Hmm. Hey, Ollie. <laughs> doing that is a cute thing. Hang on, buddy. Yeah, there we go. It's pretty right. Hey, you know what? I'm gonna teach you how to play guitar. When your hands are bigger. And you're not pooping your pants all the time. <laughs> yeah, that helps. It's all right. Everybody does. <laughs> we just leave her because. A lot of stories to tell you. Yeah, she lives a little. When you're older. But <sighs> much older. <laughs> I don't even know where to begin. Just wait just a few seconds more. Maybe there's just some more. If not, I can just cut it out. So, Okay. Now let's go back. That potato song, by the way, we should go check out Mama. actually stuck into my head since I heard it the first time. I don't know why. 
it's really cute. I wonder if it's an actual song. Um, or whether that was just... Oh, look at the Ollie in the back of those. Those jeans in all... Like in this game and in The Walking Dead, the jeans always fit to a T. I want jeans like that. Like, I guess jeans in the zombie... Like everything is horrible in a post-apocalyptic world except go the fit of your jeans. Yeah, he's a heavy boy. Yeah, I got it. Oh, we can do barbecues. So what do we have here? Squash. Nah. Actually, don't. My my stomach doesn't like. Well, that's too much info for you. Scarecrow. Oh, chickens. Hello, ladies. Does he need his jacket? No, he's fine. Tomato, tomato, my body, tomato. Oh, more? <laughs> you can tell me this time. Should I stop? Okay, enough. Seriously? <laughs> oh! Reminds me of that Simpsons sketch. Here. Mm. Alright, there you go. Oh, 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 gentle, gentle, gentle. Just like that. Here you go. Oh! Yeah. Hey, hey, I'll take him. Can you get the sheep into the barn? Oh, I got him. I can do it. Yeah? Yeah. Won't you rest it up? <laughs> okay. Here. Come on. Put you in there. Don't stay out too long. You still need the bath. Shh. I'm like a herding master. To be quite honest, I would feel incredibly uncomfortable. Up, sheep. Your dinner awaits you in the barn, so come on. Yeah, in a second, I just want to look at everything here. Because this is cool. All the details. Let's appreciate the world building that the team did. Look. Oh, that's where they can take a bath. Um, I would feel incredibly uncomfortable with a baby living that isolated. Like, I would not want that because... Yes, it's gated and everything, but if infected, go really hog wild, then, you know, I don't think this is really that helpful. Um, Snowy, barn time. So, yeah, I would actually rather have stayed in Jackson. I know that, oh, horsey, can I, no, can, can I, no, hmm. I thought I can, um, Pet the horse. I know that Jackson probably still reminds Ellie too much of Joel, but it's protection for the kid. You know, and in case something is happening, especially, you know, with um, health issues or whatever, then it's always better in a community. Like, you're so much more um, safe and secure in a community. Get on in. Damn, look at those. Wow. That's a lot of sheep. L look at that. Yeah. How many do you think that is? I don't even know how you... The teats, how do you call them in English? Better stop. Oita, is it in... Although, I think that was a male. That was not... <laughs> I wouldn't milk that. <laughs> Move it or lose it. There you go. Don't you dare. Come on. Definitely. And now the little one. Oh, sorry. Hey, Cutie pie. Tasty snack. Oh. Okay, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Hey. How'd you get out? Yeah. Didn't he just? He just walked in there. We saw him, or her. 
Oh, shit. Oh, that's trauma. That is a panic attack. Come on, little guy. Oh, damn. Do you want to eat? No, don't go out. That's PTSD. She had a panic attack because, damn, you know. Hey. Oh man. It's good. Haven't had a, any excitement in a while. I think Jackson would also help because she would have more people. Like, Dina has to take care of the baby. She can't be emotionally available always for Ellie. And Ellie is dealing with a lot. So she would have more people to talk about, you know, her, her issues. And maybe even a professional. Because PTSD is no joke. Like, you, she probably would need pills and treatment. Oh, that's pretty. Again, it like being so isolated, it fills me with anxiety. Oh, I see a horse. Is that ours? I know whose horse it is. But I want to make it interesting for you. Maybe it's Jesse's mom. I don't know how far ahead we are in this. Like how how long has it been with with JJ being I don't know half a year, a year? Oh. Can I pet the horse? Oh, it's from Jackson. That's the stamp. Who are you here with? Hi. Can I pet you? Oh, why don't... Ellie, why are you not petting the horse? What nonsense is this? Hey, where you been? Hunting. Took a little longer than I thought. Who's here? Uh, just come inside. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Well, that's quite a bit you got there. Hey, Tommy. There you are. Here, we take it. Come here, bud. Oh, yeah. Go. Here. Oh, I got it. I got oh, it. damn. Yeah, he's an. Hey. He's a vet. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to see you. Mm, you too. <laughs> you getting heavy. No, he's <laughs> just a big ball of muscle. Hmm? <laughs> Town's good. Maria good? Oh, she's fine. We, uh,. We're taking some time apart. Understandable. Mm. Sorry. Nah. We talked about it a lot. And, uh, yeah, it's what we both want. I don't think so. She broke up with you, Tommy. Uh, okay. Oh. Come sit. I got something to show you. 
So I've been putting out feelers. No! For months now. And this new guy heard my story. He told me about a woman that he traded with while he was moving through California. Described her as built like an ox, traveling with a kid with scars across his face. He said they're living along this coast in a beach sailboat right here. Fuck off, Tommy. That's gotta be her. Look at her face. Damn. We're done with that, so. <clears throat> well, I can't go. I know. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Reckon it's easy. Forget about her. You sitting all comfy way out here? Hey. I'll make her pay. Tommy. That's what you said when we got back to Jackson. Tommy. What a joke. You're a joke, Tommy. Can you take him, please? Yeah. Here. I got you. I got you. Hey. What the fuck was that? God damn it, Tommy, you know what we've been- I'll say it. She made me a promise. I don't fucking care. I know you don't, know. That's your goddamn problem. Listen to me. Go ahead, go. Good on you, Dina. And Allie, you better- Oh, look at that scar. Also, look at those fat cheeks. Damn, JJ. Yep. You're adorable. So, here's <coughs> what I think. Um, I was. First of all, um, I know a lot of people thought Tommy was shot and dead, and I, I watched a few Let's Plays where people were like, well, but how? This is not logical. Um, I watched that scene where he gets shot a few times, and it's actually made in a way he it is realistic that he has survived this, because he only gets grazed, basically, by the bullet, and as you could see, it I think he's blind on, on one eye. So it makes total sense. Oh. Happened again. Got rid of the images pretty quickly, but my skin hurt the rest of the morning. I gave up trying to go back to sleep. Dina stayed up with me. When will this stop? Look, if this is not only, you know, like you see things, but also you feel like you have physical things happening, like the skin hurt, like she needs to go to a doctor. I don't know how Dina talks so easily about Jesse. She tells JJ all about him. She thinks I'd be good for me. It'd be good for me to talk about Joel, to get it out. When she says that it makes the memory sound like food poisoning. Oh, sorry. When she says that it makes the memory sound like food poisoning. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. It's just going to hurt. And I think once I'd start, I wouldn't be able to stop. I don't think it would be too bad that she would just, you know, babble on and get out with it. Took JJ on a ride today. He laughed the whole time. I always almost didn't think about Seattle all day. It was nice. Oh yeah, let's look at the pretty... Look at that. Oh god, pudgy little JJ. He's cute. 
Jesse's parents came out today. It was nice at first. They're good people. But then they started pushing for us to move back to Jackson. I couldn't handle it and le left for the woods. I didn't came ba come back until late at night. Dina stayed up for me. I could tell she was mad, but she grabbed my hand and led me to bed. I feel so guilty. It happened again. I was hunting this boar and I'd cornered it in this old gas station. It was bleeding out, screaming, sounded like him. Then I couldn't get the images out of my head. I left it there, dying. My skin hurts. They actually did that scene, but they cut it from the game. That's what I read. Also, this is another flashback from the dinosaur museum scene where uh, the boar surprises her. Maybe that's why she had that flashback, because of that moment. When does it get quiet? Time was supposed to suffocate the urge, suffocate the desire, extinguish, extinguish the desire. Haunted by your stare, smiles, the mask keeps getting heavier. It's sliding off my face. One step forward, two steps back. There's a noose around my neck and the further I get, the tight. it's harder and harder to breathe. Can I find a way to cut the cord rope? It's also kind of funny because of um, that scene with Abby where she was actually, you know... Um, I've been waiting for dawn, but the light is all gone. I've lost the light. Don't know if I'm already blind. Can I leave it all behind? <sighs> yeah, sh Al Allie needs help. So, <clears throat> um, the first time I played this through, I thought Tommy was dead. And it really struck me very hard because I loved Tommy in the first game. And actually, when I saw that he had survived, I broke out crying. Like, it was a really, like, just a gigantic, heavy, ugly cry. And then he instantly turned into a total asshole. And I think... Oh, later. Later, Grader. We'll continue this. Oh, that's the night. That's the night. That's the previous night before the game starts. It's a very pretty song. There's Dina flirting. Isn't that also from the teaser where everyone got their knickers in a bunch? about my patrols don't go here don't go there it's funny how involved he gets whenever you're scheduled to go out yeah she's uh she's putting on quite the show i give you guys two weeks until you're back together not gonna happen <laughs> she uh say something to you Make it one week. Ellie! Hey! What took you so long? Well, I'm here, aren't I? Dina? Jesse? Damn! Dina! Hey, don't forget, we're heading out early, so get some rest. Yes, sir. You're such a dick. Come on. Why don't you start with me? Okay, I have a very serious question for you. How bad do I smell? <laughs> like... 
like a hot pile of garbage. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> how about that? Gross. <laughs> you love it. Every guy in this room is staring at you right now. Maybe they're staring at you. Or not. Maybe they're jealous of you. I'm just a girl, not a threat. Family event. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Remember next time there's kids around. Yeah, like you're setting such a great example. Oh, just what this town needs. Another loudmouth dyke. Oh, fuck you. The fuck did you just say? Hey, Ellie, hey. Ellie, don't. Get the hell out of here. Get your hands off me. Hey! Enough. Go for a walk. What about them? You worry about yourself. Let's get you some fresh air. You are a ghetto. What is wrong with you? He had no right. And you do? I don't need your fucking help, Joel. Right. No! No, Ellie! Ugh. I mean, we knew this would happen because this was going on and on and on. Hey. But still, no! since he slept this long, huh? He had a day. Yeah. He's fine. Go back to bed. We'll talk about it in the morning, okay? I have to finish it. Oh, oh that scar from the fight. You don't owe Tommy anything. I don't sleep. I don't eat them. I'm, I'm not like you, Dina. What? You think this is easy? For you and for him, I deal with it. I love you. Prove it. Stay. So what? I'm just supposed to, to sit here and wait for you? For God knows how long, just thinking you're fucking dead the entire time? I don't plan on dying. Yeah, well, neither did Jesse. Or Joel. Hey, stop. Hey. Hey. Come on. We've got a family. She doesn't get to be more important than that. That's true. No. <sighs> I'm not going to do this again. Good for you, Dina. It's up to you. 
That's a shitty thing to say. Fuck you, Will. Like, honestly, you know... Even to say that it's easy for Dina, just because she does the work to get through her emotions, to work through it. But Ellie learned from Joel, and Joel's like, push it down, deep down, and ignore it. That's how you deal with emotional damage. Laugh is looking good. Now we just need. Oh, I checked this street a week ago. I can't believe you traded a pistol for this. It's elite. No way that guy saw fireflies over here. Stop. I feel good about this. Well, I don't. Come on. Okay, let's go. 24, 10. It's not going to be on that side. It's all evens. 24, 09. So 24, 25 should be that way. Yeah. If. The fireflies are still out there. Yeah. What do you think they're up to? I don't know. The goal was always to restore society. I mean, there's all sorts of ways to go about it. Where are you going? Just a sec. Just looking around. Also waiting for an opportunity. To explain my Tommy um, theory. <laughs> Seems like a strange place to find a resistance group. We had all sorts of outposts, big and small. Best way to hide from the army. Oh, what's that? That's weird graffiti. Does that mean fireflies? No. Nothing I recognize. At no. Least. They had a cool symbol. This is like, are we the baddies? If you don't know that joke, um, I'll post the sketch in the links. It's one of my favorite Something sketches like in the world. Oh, crap. Do I have it? Yeah, th what's my. Damn. Oh, damn, damn. that it um <clears throat> so regarding tommy um i was really shocked that he did this 180 because when we were still in this in the um in the theater he actually told like he asked ellie is it okay if we turn back oh uh, yeah and um so he was okay with with not you know finishing this So I think what changed is basically, I mean, he lost, he went out on his own and Ali, Dina and Jesse basically went after him and then Jesse died.
Jesse died, but also um, Tommy lost. Good. I mean, he can't fight anymore. He. Yes, you did. Keep your guard up. Let's go back to finding that house. 24-25. Attaboy. He lost part of his eyesight. He, um... You know, he can't walk properly anymore. Wait. The Rattlers are here. No one is going to make me their fucking slave. Andrew, Logan, Ori. Daddy is coming to see you. Oh, they committed suicide. I mean, the logo, the graffiti logo, wasn't that the snake? Assuming all the leads dry up, what would you like to do? I don't know. Leave this place? Okay. And where would we go? West. See what's out there. It's nothing but ocean. And past it? Other countries, I guess. You want to do that? Why not? <laughs> Good question. <sighs> what do you want to do for dinner tonight? We've got those lobsters I caught yesterday. <laughs> Twenty-four, twenty-nine. Too far. Twenty-four, twenty-two. <laughs> really close now. And because he lost so much, it has to mean something. But if they leave Abby alive, it feels more for him as if it all was for completely nothing. What? Nothing. More symbols. Mm-hmm. So he has to go back, he has to kill Abby, so he can tell himself that it meant something. That's that he at least achieved what he went out to do. So that's my theory, why he turned into this big asshole. It's really just not properly dealing with what happened. But that's revenge for you, I mean it will never be really fulfilling, I think. Unless it's some like light, you know, amusing revenge. Like a little prank, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> this place looks abandoned. Like all the other houses. Turtle Zoo. Keep searching. Yeah, so on the, they're on the lookout for the fireflies. Sorry, I had to get this Tommy theory out because it really it bothered me because I loved Tommy so much in the first game, and then he turned around and was so horrible. And I. And I think because I was so relieved that he was alive, and then he was like such a dick. This is the place. Okay, but there's nothing here. We don't. Because he was then yet. such a dick. That was so frustrating for me. It was like I was rooting for you, Tommy, and you turn around and act like a fool. So yeah. <laughs> Also sorry for constantly interrupting the small discussions, but I painted the indoors to look like the outdoors, but plants don't look like that. It's more like a a child's dream version of the outdoors. In the old world, it'd be common for them to decorate kids' rooms like this. My dad painted a a colorful jungle for me. Oh. I would have loved that. I bet you would have. You know, that exchange is very cute, but I can't believe that they've been, you know, on the go for such a long time. And still, like, how 
weltfremd ist the German word, like how far away from the world is left still that he asks these kind of questions. Like at some point it's like, come on, this shtick of, I don't know w things because I grew up in a cult. Like at a certain point you kind of have to, right? <laughs> I mean, he's been with Abby so much, they probably spend some time in houses. I don't know, sorry, just observe that. Like, because I played this game through twice now, the whole... I don't know what things are, I don't get humor, I don't get references like Goober, that's... I get that. Oh, look at that. Oh. Um, but at a certain point it's like, come on, you know. You know paintings, you know, like... Maybe there's another way in. Are you being positive? trying to be helpful you're always helpful oh she's so good oh yeah i <laughs> she's very good with laugh i'm sorry i'm all over the place because i constantly get interrupted with her conversations <laughs> or i am interrupting their conversations more likely everything's empty yeah what no this it's not i'm getting Oh, you mean, well, that would have been weird. Like, every all the fireflies stacked it here, like, surprise! <laughs> Remember the last time we were in a pool? Yeah, I have a small recollection. Uh. If it makes you feel better, I also thought we were gonna die. Nope. Yeah, that, that doesn't make anyone feel better if you say it. Nada. Is it really nothing? It can't be. Why? Hey, but I can pick. T I, I I have ten. Damn it. Hmm. Oh. Can't you really use that because I uh. Hmm. Oh well. So nothing here. Lev, I think we're done here. No, wait. You find something? Oh yeah, I see it. Scratches. Smart boy. <laughs> yeah, that's... Come on, Lev. <laughs> Scooch. Yeah. <laughs> nice try, Lev. Like, that's admirable. <laughs> Hello? No, oh, it's abandoned. Weird. Been a while since anyone's been here. Unfortunately, I have to agree with you. Pretty nice barracks, all things considered. They were here for a while. That's the shower, right? Mm hmm You don't know showers, like, <laughs> come on, come on. We didn't just pick him up from the cult. He spent so much time with Abby. They surely talked about stuff. Guess they've got solar. This is really sitcom territory here, where at some point it's like, come on, we've been in season six, at some point the cult person kind of knows stuff. Map of California, okay. Is 
Is this frequency currently in use? This is... Do you see a call sign anywhere? Oh, a what? It's a short list of numbers and letters. Hmm. Okay. This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? Standing by. Is anyone out there? What's this? Those are frequencies. Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Is anyone out there? Are these other Firefly outposts? I don't know. That scar on Abby's arm, the one... Can anyone hear me? Where Ellie Hello? shot her? Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Hello. Hello. Is this frequency currently in use? Hello, this is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? If anyone can hear me, please reply. Please answer. Hi, Abby. We got a clear signal on you. Where in Santa Barbara are you calling from? Um, 24, 25 Constance. Uh, we got a tip about a base, but there's no one here. We're looking for fireflies. I'm a, I'm a firefly. Where were you stationed? I was part of the Salt Lake outpost. Who ran that facility? Dr. Jerry Anderson. He was my dad. Well, how about that? We pulled everyone back from the satellite stations and brought them back here to home base. How many of you are there? More about. 200 strong now, with a few more every month. Oh, was right. You're about to get two more. How do we find you? Get to Catalina Island. Approach the large domed building in Avalon. We'll find you. Okay. Okay, we'll see you soon. Over and out. Looking forward to it. Yay! Good luck, Abby from Santa Barbara. Over and out. Come on, let's get back to the sailboat. Okay, fine. You were right. Uh, what was that? Why do you make me repeat whenever I'm wrong? Because it makes me feel better. <laughs> and because it happens so rarely. Oh, she's so good with him. Like, she's really very, like, older sister, motherly. It's very lovely. Like we've seen her with her friends and she's a bit, she's a bit she was a kind of a bit harsh with her friends like teasingly but still. And with with Lef she's a lot more soft. Which I think is good for her because I think she hit that soft side because of her, you know, I'm not like the other girls um whole stick. Also Adventures with the Fireflies would be a great continuation for a th possible third part with new characters. Like completely new characters. Maybe some Abby and Lev, but maybe also some completely new characters. I would love that. Damn. Whoa. What? Nope. Uh, I'm now. Up. Oh, there are the rattlers. Come here, let me see. Just push R one. Fuck, man. 
You're fine. Get that little one. Oh, they even have it on their vests. Oh no, Lef. Don't you fucking touch him! <gasps> That's totally like Ellie from the first scene when they. Oh my god, I only noticed that. There's so many throwbacks in this game. It's. This is solely Ellie! Jesus, I have to do like a. I have to do a collection of all of that because that's always like I, I notice with every new playthrough I notice something new that's kind of a throwback to another scene in the game. Oh Ellie, you asshole, you left Dina. Can't get over that. Just like, you know, just like Owen would have left Mel. It's not a thing to do. Also, you look bad. Damn. Put on some sunscreen. Two four two five constants. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Oh yeah, let's look at the diary first. Um Okay, that's where we Dixie National Forest. Couple hunters tried to jump me, didn't go well for them. Yeah, she's I think quite quite the fiend as of now. I just got to the outskirts of Las Vegas. I can hear the infected from here. Must be thousands still alive inside the walls. What a nightmare. I'm gonna go around. Ew. Palm Day, California. So I'm hiding out in a basement hoping this horde passes by. I miss you, potato. Still in this fucking basement. The batteries in my flashlight are almost done. The dark is fucking with me. I keep seeing him smelling iron. I miss Tina. I miss potato. What am I doing here? I got out. The horde got distracted by a group of travelers. Some of them didn't make it. Two of the bodies were kids. I buried them. Made it to the coast finally. It's gorgeous. Flowers everywhere. There's this thick morning gloom. Doesn't seem like the military ever came through. Maybe it was too spread out. I wish Dina could see this. She would lose her shit. I like the sound of the waves. Heading down the coast, haven't seen people in a few days. Or intact sailboats. What if Tommy was wrong? What if they're not here anymore? I can't think about that. Oh, that's it. Oh, so many pictures of JJ. Oh, a little chubby arm. Mm. Wait, does she have other notes? No, that's just... okay. Oh. So the good info I traded those fish for turned out to be bogus. Despite our repeated dead ends, my gut tells me the fireflies are in Santa Barbara. Somewhere, I'm picturing the snark I'd be getting if you heard me say that. Shut up. Gonna check out another tip back in the suburbs. Wish us luck. She riding Owen. I was sitting by the fire at night with Lef, looking at the waves, thinking about you. I told him your stupid joke about the skateboarding grandma. <laughs> He laughed so hard he spit out his food. It's the happiest I've seen him yet. I miss you. Oh. You'd have liked it here. There are no towns, just small caravans that move up and down the coast. Everyone says Santa Barbara is haunted, like some Bermuda Triangle. I think it's beautiful. I saw a seal the other day. It had spots. Is this some karmic way of you mocking me? God damn. Everything's sad. Everything is sad. Okay, folks. I'm going to cut it here. How would she get up to the street from here? I think we're heading on like I think the next episode will be the last of us <laughs> playing the last of us. Um and yeah, I will like I it's not like I have played for such a long time but it's kind of um been emotional again and a little bit you know exhausting 
So I will cut it here and then we'll we'll finish this in the next episode. Um, I hope you had fun with this or enjoyed it or took something from it. Um, have a very nice day. If you like this, like this. Follow me, comment, do your thing. Um, and einen wunderschönen Tag noch. <laughs> bye bye.